Hi everyone, welcome to Imaging Study. Today we are going to see a case of obstructed inguinal hernia. An elderly male patient came with painful, irreducible right inguinal lump. Let's see what we have got on ultrasound. Here you can see the high frequency view of the right testis. It appears normal. When we are tracing upwards, you can see a herniated structure is noted at the level of superficial inguinal ring. As we are tracing upwards, the neck of the hernia looks quite narrower. This is the starting point and surrounding fat appears thickened. So this narrow neck with surrounding fat stranding suggests it as an obstructed inguinal hernia. You can see the bowel loop as well as some ecogenic fat surrounding it as contents. Color Doppler shows no whirlpool sign or any other abnormality which may suggest strangulation. This is the ecogenic fat surrounding the neck as a feature of obstruction. Here is the picture showing the right testis with the herniated sac at the level of superficial inguinal ring. This is another picture. You can see the sac diameter is around 24 mm with bowel loop and fat as contents. This is the neck diameter which appears around 8 mm with surrounding fat thickening indicating it as an obstructed inguinal hernia. This is the view of the narrow neck of the hernia which caused the obstruction. As this is an indirect inguinal hernia, the obstruction is a very common feature here. So in summary, an irregular herniated structure containing bowel loop and fat with a narrow neck and surrounding fat stranding is noted at the right inguinal canal extending up to the superficial inguinal ring, suggesting it as a case of right-sided irreducible indirect inguinal hernia. Now the take-home message. Color Doppler ultrasound may help exclude strangulation in a case of obstructed hernia. Thank you for watching this video. Subscribe to our YouTube channel for more. See you on the next one. Have a nice day.